Cincinnati has big plans for its next season, including that Kimberly Akimbo. Some fresh Tony winners like that one and favorites we love to see again and again, like Les Mis. Genevieve Holt is the Midwest Vice President of Broadway Across America. So good to see you, Genevieve. Oh, it's nice to be here. Oh, I, I just love the Broadway series. It's one of my favorite things about living here. So let's start it all out with a really a big favorite. Mama Mia is coming back in September. Yes. So Mama Mia is here during election season. We thought that'd be a nice antidote to <laughs> what else goes on in the world this fall. It'll bring um, us together, right? That's right. That's right. And, um, you know, it's a fresh new tour, you know, the songs of ABBA, the great storyline. Um, so we're excited to have it back. Now, I'm really excited, too, about Funny Girl, the revival. It was huge in New York City. Yes. It's having a moment with Barbara Streisand's biography and some legendary Lifetime Awards coming out. Tell me a little bit about Funny Girl, the revival. Well, you know, it really never toured um, when it, even when it, the original version. So this is one of the first times there's this big, beautiful national tour of Funny Girl going out. And um, it's a joy. It's a delightful show. You know, the talent in it is amazing. Um, and if you only know the movie, you know, it's a wonderful chance to just see it on stage and see, you know, the spectacle of it. I'm really excited about that. I just watched the movie again and oh. forgot about how many songs are in that great show. Such great songs. Yeah, yeah. we started with that little clip from Kimberly Akimbo, which is a real strange story but it looks like so much fun it's it's lovely it's one of those shows I think people will go because it's on their subscription and they will never forget it mm -hmm. I mean it is such a heart a, you know, heartwarming story, but great comedy. It's just, it's very, very special. What's it about for people who don't okay, know? Okay, <laughs> it's, it's hard to explain, but it is about a girl, like a 15 year old girl, just moved to a new town. She's dealing with all these things of going to a new school and making friends, but she also has a disease that has her aging. Um, so she looks 60 years old, but she's 16 inside. Wow. Um, and it is so beautiful. I know that sounds a little weird, but really is just such a such an awesome show. Well, it it's, sounds like it has a good yes. message, too. Yes. Neil Diamond fans are going to be excited. A Beautiful Noise is coming. Yes. So in the, you know, in the vein of Jersey Boys or Beautiful, the Neil Diamond musical, A Beautiful Noise, tells the story of kind of the career of Neil Diamond and the ups and downs and, of course, has all his amazing music. Um, it might end with Sweet Caroline and a sing-along. It's a <laughs> oh, lot of fun. It would have to. It would yes. have to. Uh, you, you were just telling me and Bob uh, during the break here that one of the ones you're really excited about is And Juliet, yes. which is a new take on Romeo and Juliet, right? It is. So um, in, the, in the show, uh, William Shakespeare is talking to his wife, and she has the good idea of saying, what if Juliet doesn't die? What if from then on, she forges her own path and, and finds her own joy. Um, and so that's what it tells. It tells yeah. the story of what, what happens if Julia really like went on from that moment and, and oh. reclaimed is her life. Is that family friendly? I think girls need it to see really that. It really is. And yeah. the music is by Max Martin, this like pop producer who's written so many hits. Um, so it has like Backstreet Boys songs and Britney Spears and Katy Perry songs <laughs> and wow. Kelly Clarkson. And so the music, it's kind of in the vein of Moulin Rouge yes. that um, you kind of are smiling the whole time because oh. you love Love these oh, yeah. songs it's it's great and and just in the time left some of the favorites that are coming back come from away one of my favorites of all time yes mine too yeah Les Mis and something for Christmas the Grinch yes, the Grinch will be back <laughs> it's been I think 11 or 12 years since we had it so wow, really Has yeah it been that long yeah oh my gosh. so we thought it'd be um, a lot of fun to have back how much here. like the cartoon is the musical very similar okay very similar but it's fun I think for kids especially to see it all on stage live yeah. is really fun I, and it's great to go out at Christmas time with your family and do something yes, like it's that true so are tickets available yet? Yes. So right. our renewing subscribers got renewed. Okay. Then anybody that didn't renew, we just released their seats this week. All right. So those, that new inventory is out there right now at broadwayincincinnati.com. Okay. And we'll put the link on ours too, local12.com. Thanks, Genevieve. Thanks, Sounds Sheila. like a great season. Hey there. Thanks so much for visiting the Local 12 YouTube channel. Click the links, hit subscribe to get notified anytime we post content to this channel.